Hey there, in this video we'll be learning about magnets and how they work. If you don't know what a magnet is, it is an object that sticks to iron or steel. To understand how a magnet works, I will show you a demonstration. These are two magnets. The black side is the south pole and the blue side is the north pole. Every magnet has two poles. When the magnets are brought together, two things can happen. Magnets can either stick together or push apart. When they push apart, we say that the magnets repel. When they stick together, we say that they attract. But why do these two things happen? Here is a simple rule about magnets you must remember. North and north repel. South and south repel. North and south attract. South and north attract. In other words, like poles repel and opposite poles attract. This is how magnets work. But why does it work this way? The answer is magnetism. Magnetism is a force. A force is either a push or a pull. You can feel the magnetic force when you pull two attracting magnets apart and push two repelling magnets together. The force of magnetism is what makes magnets act the way they do. But how do magnets stick to iron? When a magnet comes close to iron, it will attract. But applying the rule of opposites attract, we can find out what pole the iron will become. If the south pole of a magnet sticks to the iron, the iron will become the north pole. If the north pole of a magnet sticks to the iron, the iron will become the south pole. The iron becomes a temporary magnet. The magnetism in the iron is called induced magnetism. But what will happen if you cut a magnet in half? Will there be a magnet with just a south or north pole? The answer is no. A magnet will always have a north and south pole. So separating a magnet in half would create two magnets, each with a north and south pole. That's all for this video. Hope you learned about magnets and how they work. See you guys next time.